Your wife has been kidnapped. They could hold her for 20 years, or they could kill her tomorrow. I want to help you. Can't let her die. We need to get in there now. Echo 3 is a geopolitical thriller about an American scientist in Colombia on a research project who gets kidnapped and held hostage by a young Colombian militia. And the American government, for a number of reasons, is unable or unwilling to secure her release. The White House doesn't even want to hear about her. They won't engage. So her brother and husband, who are highly trained Delta Force soldiers, take things into their own hands. You might see her as this damsel in distress, but what you find is that she's tough as nails and willing to do whatever it takes to get back to her family. Don't fantasize of our rescue. They can't find this place. You don't know my family? What makes the show original is how deep it dives into the characters and their relationships as they fight their way through this life and death situation of trying to get reunited. The truth is democracy is dead in North America. We reject your influence. I wanted to write a thriller that was more nuanced than just good versus evil. I wanted these characters that are lethal and dangerous, but also have emotional flexibility and vulnerability. You did nothing wrong, then. We're gonna find a way out of this which I hope gives people the sense that they're getting something special. I don't have a choice. I have to get her out. This feels much more like a sweeping, immersive, 10 hour long film. You're hooked by the first episode and then you're in it until the end. You're gonna see a spectacle of drama, of tense action. It will be an edge of seat experience and I don't think we've seen anything like this before.